Welcome back, Shaw family. Today, I'm going to be reacting to episodes 5 and 6 and 7 and 8. All right? So, we know in the last episode, um, Tanjiro and the gang, they faced like a crazy-ass challenge. They was going up against the nigga, the demon, who could split into like mad different people and shit. And um, that nigga was definitely a problem. But, you know, Tanjiro was very quick to think on his feet and shit. You know, he was fighting, I think the one that's named joy the flying nigga so he was quick to think on his feet to use him as a trajectory you know stab him with his sword and then take them back to the i was gonna say take it back to the crib like they about to get it on what well they about to get it on and pop in like yeah about to square up but <laughs> not the other thing hey yo but yeah we're so yeah and then um i think the other nigga just fan these motherfuckers away um into the ground like the gravity was so like sick and intense like it, it hit nezuko and tanjiro unconscious so like yeah and i know um what's this nigga's name genya i know that nigga is always with the glock and the sword like that is a deadly ass combo like i still can't recall like what nigga in anime brings a sword and a glock to a fight Y'all let me know. I mean, the only thing I'm thinking is, like, probably, like, Attack on Titan. You know, when Kenny versus, um, um, Anchorman. What's this dude? No, Levy. Levy, sorry. <laughs> no, wait. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm fucking up. But this dude, this dude, yes. Levi was facing, um, his former teacher. But, yeah, like, basically oh kenny that's his name of course like i had to think about levi shouting out his name he's like kenny like yeah 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 yeah. kenny that's that nigga's name yeah so that's the only one i could really see in the anime who be bringing you know guns to like a sword fight but you know they got the the tuli stuff i said the tuli stuff they got the shit so you know to snap open um the titan's neck and shit you know that's not technically a sword but i feel like it is like sword related you know what i'm saying but nonetheless yeah like kenny is that nigga though but that shit was crazy and no i didn't caught up to all of season four yet of attack on Titan. but who the fuck cares okay so yeah we're about to jump right into this episode all right let's go <laughs> Yeah, his sword is really bad. I said sword, wow. <laughs> sword is really chipped badly, yeah. Bright red sword. Okay, that sword has to be Tanjiro's. The one that's the name of the episode. Bro, you can't be for sure. Demons are everywhere. Is he going to get rid of it right away? Let's see. He's a hot short after all. I look good today on stream. I just realized. <laughs> I'm like, wait a second. What I still don't understand is... I'm just like, yo, bro, like, aren't y'all, like... The Swordsmith's Village arc, right? Yeah, it's supposed to be Swordsman. Cut that nigga up. Damn, she is fast. It beautiful. Mm. Oh damn, that nigga dead. But I understand, like, they never dealt with demons invading their village before. Nobody knows where their village is located at. So. Mm hmm. That's fire. For it to curve like that. Like, how can you make a sword in the shape of a whip? And it could move around like a fucking whip. But mind you, it's a sword. <laughs> That's fire. <laughs> yeah, and her big ass boobs is right in his face. <laughs> I fell on my head too. <laughs> Please hold my hand. <laughs> How they fighting over a touch him? <laughs> For her to like hold him, I'm dying. Damn, Nezuko was dumb fast, yo. <laughs> now Tanjo's the one carrying her. That shit's gonna blow him away, yep. 
cut. Yep, she's gonna cut her hair with it, right? Bro, what are you saying? Don't you realize why she's cutting her fucking hands? <laughs> yeah, this creepy squirmy nigga needs to die, yo. I'm tired of him. God damn. Oh, that's disgusting. Death throws of the Smiths. That's messed up. This nigga is mad cruel, yo. Nigga, they're not moved because you created this masterpiece in your own words. They're fucking sad because you took their buddies away. It's fucking sickening, too. Like, these niggas are still alive. Nigga, oh my god. They're in, like, great pain and agony. I can only imagine. Not just, yep, not so fast. The upper moons are dumb fast. That's dumb for you. That's so crazy. His design is interesting. To have mouths as eyes is crazy. What's up with these um Goldeen and, and Sea King looking like Pokemon motherfuckers and Demon Slayer? I will say those fish kind of do look better than Goldeen <laughs> and Sea King. Going back to a haunted ass memory. What? Water prison. Oh my god. This is like an ending zero just not that long ago in season two. Captured niggas in water. But I feel like he should get out of this. Like, Miss is kind of a derivative of water, you know? Like, mind you, he's not the water Harashiro, so. You know. That's fire. <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> His ancestor's memory. Mm -hmm. Your father. Now let me stop. So use it to your full benefit, fam. Yes, bro. <laughs> they didn't even sense him like that. Where's the, um, where's all four now? Oh, shit. Super Saiyan time. Sun Halo Dragon. Speed off. Yes. Yes. Attack this leaf motherfucker. Fire is, is super effective against grass. Come on. Yes. Niggas realize a split second too late about, <laughs> about the whole shit. That's nice. Fucking fire dragon dance is crazy. But where's the fourth one though? Remember this four of them? All the time? That'd be nice. That's what I'm saying. Bro. Mm hmm. What the hell? He a demon? I'm lost. Can he turn into a demon? Is it because of the moon? I need answers. No, bitch. You need to go into the next episode. So let's go. <laughs> episode six. <laughs> Aren't you going to become a Hashira? Is the name of the episode. No, but right. You got to understand. I never... Girl, you gotta understand, it's been a long time since I watched. No fucking way. He's not putting it back on his head. It's because that old nigga. But nah, no, right. I really haven't seen. I haven't watched. I said watch. Oh my God. I haven't read Demon Slayer in a long ass time. I mean, I think since 2019, sometime in 2020. That's when I read all the chapters. So it's been a long time since I remember what happened. So for me, I feel like watching this is like sort of brand new, you know? I kind of speed through this arc really quick too in the manga. It's right behind you. What if he's the sixth demon? <laughs> he's like, <"Hey."> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh shit. 
Wait, she kind of went back. Oh, okay, I was gonna say, wait, she kind of went back to going down. It's a kid size, but nope. <laughs> right, that ass though. He was like, wait, huh? What? And I'm just like, bruh. I'm trying to remember what anime character that remind me of. Mm hmm, the old nigga. I can't stand his ass, yo. How he's gonna handle these two, though, without Nezuko's help? Damn. That one is OD powerful. It's like a fucking whirlwind about to sweep him away. Yes. Oh, damn, he stabbed her. Motherfucker. That's cool. That's a really good-ass water prison. Damn, through the tree? Ooh. Mm-hmm. And he's quick to think on his feet all the time. Mm-hmm. He learns very quick in a fight. Mm -hmm. That freaking gravity push again. Nigga want to be pain so bad from Naruto. Fuck out of here. <laughs> the fact that uh, Tanjiro can still talk while being kicking in the freaking stomach OD heart is crazy. Oh, no wonder why he couldn't see it. So when all four of his personalities split up, he shrinks. Nah, bro, you gotta cut it. You gotta somehow stop it in his tracks. It's also great to hear Bakugo's voice. He can't cut him? Did the bullet deflect it? Oh, man. No, you're not. So he is a half demon. He would go into a freaking background. Little background story. Damn, that nigga mad brawlicking tall. I was just gonna say, which one is Genya? And damn, for, for her to have an abusive ass husband and she had mad kids with that nigga, I would never. Like, that's crazy. That's crazy. Like, bitch, you're dumb. I'm sorry, but you're dumb. Don't tell me their mom got killed by a demon. He was so happy back then, Genya. Four, five, six. Damn, so she has six kids in total with this nigga. Nah, you doing a lot, bitch. I'm sorry. I, like, I, I don't get how you can have so many kids with an abusive-ass nigga. Like, bitch, do you not put yourself first? Like, that's crazy. No, the fuck is not. It's, um, it's their brother. Just like that. So is this where he get his half-demon powers from? Damn, the only sibling that survived was his brother, right? You know, when the sun comes up, the demons don't like that shit. She was a demon. That's crazy. That's crazy. You could throw that out, Curtis. It was your mom. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. To kill your own mom, man. You know, it's like the walking dead, you know, when your family member or loved one turns to a zombie. You have no choice but to kill them. Long ass backstory while he about to die. Like, come on. So is he still alive or no? So it's an it's hereditary, like for their her you know, the kids to turn demons or something nice save Tanjiro coming through oh shit ooh weeping spears is crazy that's crazy oh yeah he dying he dying there's no way for him coming back <coughs> Damn, so he is going to die. Yeah, he could definitely slash that nigga's head off with that sword. Because that motherfucker's head is dumb tough. Like, nigga really scurrying like a fucking mouse. Yes, Tanjiro. It would end. It would freaking end right there. Okay, guys. So. <laughs> 
Now let me stop. So yeah, um, we see that Genya is basically on his last dying breath. All right, um, that motherfucker is uh is a goner. Um, even if he is a half demon or whatever, you know, he can't recover that fast. Like, I don't know. Like, yeah. So I am definitely looking forward to the next episode because yeah, I'm tired of these four motherfuckers causing shit, wreaking havoc, all that fucking shit. And that old nigga needs to die. And the nigga, the demon in the vase, he needs to die too. Uh, Muchiro needs to figure out something how he could get himself out of that water prison but yeah um y'all let me know your thoughts below and i'm gonna get going all right i'm gonna be in the next reaction johnny